which a couple is now under arrest for allegedly defrauding the municipality and the federal government out of more than a million and a half dollars. And tonight, Mayor Dave Bronson and Assembly Chair Christopher Constant are blaming each other for this big mess. Investigative reporter Rebecca Paulscher joins us now with details. Rebecca? Well, for months now, we've been tracking how those American Rescue Plan grants were spent, and now we've learned that a federal grand jury has indicted Rosaline Mavagala and Isu Fulamina Jr. for allegedly misusing more than $1.6 million. A couple applied for the grant in 2021 through their nonprofit house called House of Transformation. The Anchorage Assembly approved the money. It was supposed to be used for housing and retaining individuals suffering from chronic homelessness. House of Transformations has an office at 500 East Tudor Street. The federal indictment claims that within days of receiving the money, the couple started moving the funds from the nonprofit into personal accounts. The indictment alleges the two used hundreds of thousands of dollars to buy, pay back taxes to the IRS owed because of a for-profit business and then spent nearly $200,000 to buy cryptocurrency. All the while, according to court filings, the House of Transformation was knowingly filing false receipts and documents with the city to show it was spending money on homeless services. And in an email answer to our questions this afternoon, Mayor Bronson says the Assembly should have done a better job betting who it gave grants to. Assembly Chair Chris Constant said it was up to the administration to ensure the money was properly used. Mafaga is still serving in a two-year Anchorage commissions, including the city's Equal Rights Commission. Feds say that she was arrested yesterday at the Captain Cook Hotel. The mayor's office says he can't remove her, and she has refused to resign.